Good morning from our tent here at Hulama Beach. We are camping here for four days, but I thought today we'd bring you along and um, share with you some of the fun we're having. The girls wake up so early when we're camping. It's time to get up and get some coffee. What's up, Dan? Oh, hey guys. Dan's setting up the GoPro. We're headed to the beach later this afternoon. We've got little Munchkin Maya. Can you hey. say hi? Hi. We're actually camping with our family. So Mila is walking on the beach with her godmom, my sister-in-law, and all her cousins. But I thought right now would be the perfect opportunity to uh, show you around our campsite. Check it out. All right. All right. So over here, he's underneath the table right here. Oh, okay. We have our table and in here is full of good snacks. And you know, Dan, when we go camping, it's yes. like all the crap food. Yeah. The Fruit Loops, the chips, the Cheetos, all yeah. the goodness is in here. All the good stuff. All the good stuff. This is our dishwashing bin. And Dan washed the dishes this morning. Thank you, Dan. Of course. Camp stove, coffee, tea kettle thing. Yeah, maybe not in your mouth. Can I have that? No. All right, well then don't put it in your mouth. Fire pit. And then here's our cute little tent. And then Dan's truck is over there. So it's a pretty decent size campground. And the beach is just right over there. Super close. But come inside our tent. We have to take our shoes off first. And it's a 10 person tent. It's pretty big in here. We've got Mila over here on an air mattress, a twin air mattress. And I've got her with flannel sheets. And she's got a couple blankets. I brought the weighted blanket. And then we got these like really cool blankets. They're kind of like sleeping bag material, but they keep the girls so warm. And we bought two, one for Mila, one for Maya. We got these at Costco. So these are awesome. So that goes on her. And the girls have been sleeping pretty well. In here is Maya's, we brought her porta crib. And you guys know the best porta crib on the market is by Baby Bjorn. This thing is so light and it goes up and down in seconds. But me, Maya also has a flannel crib sheet pillow and she sleeps like a tornado. So all her blankets are everywhere, but um, yeah. Oh, you're breaking the rules. We're not supposed to have shoes on in the tent, dude. Oh man. No. <laughs> We've got the girl's bag here full of stuff. Hi. Okay. Got hey. my stuff here, toiletry bag, and then we've got a solar charger that um, we've got our sound machine, our travel one, and this is also, let me see if I can turn it on. It's also a light. Um, but yeah, we've got our solar charger charging our sound machine and some camera batteries. Nice. Hi. And then here's Dan and I's bed. It's a queen um, Hi, air mattress. And we also have flannel sheets, regular sheets, and then we have a quilt here, and then a comforter. And then Dan's bag. Hey, and bag. Oh, dude, shoes on the bed. Probably not the best idea. Okay, let's go outside, ready? Let's go. Up here we have like a little lantern, but we can stand up fully in our tent. This thing is huge. Dan, how many people can fit in here? 10 so oh, it is hotter than hot inside a tent no. 
in the afternoons. All right, we are all set up to head to the beach for an entire afternoon on the beach. Let me see, are you all set? We're getting there. You got your fins. Got the fins. You have the GoPro. Wetsuit, GoPro, sunscreen. Are we ready for a full afternoon at the beach? Yeah, let's get it. to catch the last bit of the sunset. I was giving the girls a bath, a shower, and I missed it. So nice camping on the beach. It's a little crazy though because you have to bring all your beach gear and your camping gear. It's definitely worth it in the end. It's so pretty. We just finished showers. I'm trying to catch the last bit of the sunset. We had an insane day at the beach. We were there all day, which was really fun. Now it's my turn to cook dinner, mine and my mother-in-law's time to cook dinner so we're gonna do that and uh, yeah hopefully end the night with some s'mores <sighs> camping is so much fun but it is a lot of work especially with the little ones <laughs> Okay, do I look scary? No, you just like, like a bright unicorn <laughs> shining right in my face. All right, well, I'm making my famous baked beans. Look at all this bacon. We've got some bell peppers going over here. Also, I did a recipe video for these baked beans. They are phenomenal and they're super easy. So <laughs> <laughs> I was telling I was telling them how intense it was to bathe the children in the quarter yeah. shower. Oh, three minutes. A dollar. A dollar gets you, gets you three minutes, minutes of hot-ish water. Yeah, hot and cold water. Lukewarm water. So, but I mean, it worked. Yeah, it gets the job done. But um, tantrums from everyone in the family. From head to toe. Myself included. Okay. But everyone showered and we're we're clean. We're, clean. we're happy. We're cooking. We're camping with literally like 30 other people plus their kids. So the girls are just like on their own, just having the best it's time ever. They're playing at the beach, they're playing at the park, and they've got their older cousins here. So it's been actually nice for us to like relax a yeah, little bit. Yeah. Except my anxiety is a little high because I'm like, where Constantly are they? checking. Like, who, tell who me where you're them, going. Where are they? Yeah. yeah. But it's really fun, and um, I'm really glad that we came this year. Absolutely. Because last yeah. year the world was closed. The year before that, I was pregnant, about to have yeah. Maya. So, yeah, it's been yeah, fun. Yeah, it's been a good weekend. We're trying to find a balance. We've been here for four days, but we've only vlogged one day because we wanted to, like, put the camera down and enjoy our trip. So this video might be, like, a little... All over the place. All Absolutely. So we're going to finish up these beans. We're going to have a good dinner. We're going to enjoy company and then probably pick you back up when uh, it's time for s'mores. S'more time. Yeah! All right. <laughs> How was your s'mores, bud? Oh, how's that Nutella working out? We are finally home from camping. We've been gone off the grid for four days. We're having our first 
home cooked meal back at home. Hi! We had an amazing time, but since I have Dan and Mila here, and Maya, I wanted to go around and ask you what your favorite camping memory was from the weekends. All right, Mila, what was your favorite camping memory from this weekend? Well, I have 10. You have 10 favorite memories? I can tell you one. Okay, tell me one. Uh, I like when we went to the beach and we had the snow cones. That was good. That was a fun day, right? Fun day, wait. Okay, all right, let me ask you while you're enjoying your pasta. What was your favorite camping memory from this weekend? Cupping leaking. What was your favorite part? And a sandwich and a Eat, sandwich. Eating a sandwich? Yeah. What about, are you talking about eating a s'mores with the marshmallow? Yeah. Okay, that was my favorite part too. And the, oh, and I think playing on the playground? Yeah! All right, Danny, what is your favorite camping memory from this weekend? Um, I like just spending time on the beach and then just hanging out with friends and family who we haven't seen in Mama, beach. a very long beach. time and just yeah. sitting around camp and laughing and, and sharing sharing each other's company and creating yeah. new memories. It was fun. I think I told them earlier in the video that we were camping with like six other families. There was almost about 40 people. Yeah, and like tons and tons of kids. Yeah, more so. kids than you can count <laughs> yeah. track of. It was a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Are you ready, Maya, to close this video out with me? No. All right, everyone, thank you so <laughs> much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.